Good morning, everyone. This is Warwick Smith from American Pacific, along with Eric Saderholm. Wanted to come to you this morning and talk a bit about the Madison press release that we've just put out. Uh, suffice it to say, we're very pleased with what we're seeing uh, that the work with the, with the with the great work that Rio Tinto is doing. Eric, maybe you want to just take two minutes to uh, talk to what you're excited about in this uh, update. Well, what I'm really excited about is the regional extent of the mineralization that, that becomes quite apparent from the 1700 stations that they took in these, this, this uh, soil entrenching program that they did during the year. Uh, what we've concentrated traditionally on a, a very small portion of, of the lowland position because it's, it ex, it's exposed at the surface. So you can see it, you can drill it, you can, you can mine it. There's been a little bit of mining that's been done in this. What this shows is, is the, the, the potential link up of these SCARN systems and the massive sulfide systems at depth. So we're really excited about the fact that there, we are starting to see some surface expressions and it looks like that this system can get really big at depth. So this starts to really highlight it, especially when you combine this with the geophysical data that we already have and that we will have, you start to see some real, real nice targets get highlighted very quickly. Yeah, just to chime in on that, I think one of the things that, that that's good for the market to understand is this is a 13 square kilometer um, uh, soil grid that they've run over here. And there's good grades all throughout. Typically, these systems, uh, in, in many cases, don't express themselves at the surface, if I understand correctly, Eric. Yes, a lot of times they don't. In fact, that's just the nature of the system is a lot of them are, are hidden. Uh, and and that's, what, that's what we're looking for, really. We're looking for these to link up at depth, to link up along that intrusive contact, and to link up along the same structural trend, which runs all the way to Butte. It's, it's a clear structural break. So this does link up these porphyritic systems and these types of systems along this structural trend. It's really showing up in the, geo, in the geophysics and especially the geochemistry. Yeah, well said. Uh, the, here's the other things that we're expecting from Rio uh, in Q4. Obviously the drilling uh, that we're awaiting on, we've mentioned that in the press release, we expect to have that by the end of Q4. Also, they ran a, a drone magnetic survey, which we're really excited to see. This is one of these drones that stays 25 meters above topography. That's gonna really help them with targeting going forward, uh, as well as some downhole geophysics, what we're, which we're excited to see and excited to get out to the market. So a lot of news still coming from Madison uh, that we're gonna release here in the, uh, in the, sh in the short order. I guess on top of that, we can touch probably on the other two projects um, as we've been really busy on those. Uh, Gooseberry is uh, being drilled as we speak. Uh, first hole as of Saturday night uh, was down 218 feet, hoping to hit the vein around 530 feet. Uh, so that's going along well. We're drilling 24 seven there. Uh, drills working well, teams are working out great. Very, very pleased there. It's a daytime shift and a nighttime shift. So 24 seven drilling. Uh, and then we've been really busy at Tuscarora. So Eric, maybe you wanna Touch on that for a second. Yeah, sure. Uh, the gooseberry drilling is going well, and we're very pleased that we got that drill. Uh, it's it's doing a, a really bang up job for us. Uh, what we're planning on doing with that is we're going to segue that drill into the Tuscarora drilling later in the year. So hopefully, like the last week or so of December, just about Christmas time, we'll be moving that drill over. Uh, it's a it's a core drill. It's doing a really good job. What the with the Tuscarora uh, project, we've doubled our land package recently in the last month or so. And so now we're, we've got the data and we've got it digitizing and it's, it's looking pretty good. It, it, we're, the structures are really showing up. And of course, there's some super high grades there. So we're going to file two NOIs, notices, notices of intent with the, the uh, Bureau of Land Management, the BLM. And that'll happen very shortly, probably within a week, once we have some real good firm targets. So it's such a nice, big, giant land package. We can actually have three NOIs there at the same time. So that's, that's very exciting to us. The, the, the structures are starting to really highlight. It's looking very, very good. We're, we're very pleased with what we're going to submit and very pleased with the drill showing up later in the year. Yeah, this is a, a significant land package around 3,000 acres now. And I think one of the things that's worthwhile getting across to people is we had a significant amount of data uh, on the claims that we owned before. Let's call it on the south side of the fence. This new data that we picked up on the north side of the fence, there is a lot of data there as well. So putting all of that package together uh, and selecting drill targets as they drift through uh, onto both sides is something that we've been busy working on, uh, both Eric and his entire team, along with some consultants putting together digitizing it for us so that we're ready to drill in all the right places. I think you're fairly pleased with what you're seeing in the data so far, Eric? Oh, yes, for sure. The grades are spectacular. Uh, we've released those before. It's uh, It's sort of almost otherworldly some of the high grades there. So we're really looking forward to drilling into these, these structures. It's really nice to have the land to the north because as we drilled our last program, we were moving up into that area and we were hitting some high grades. So we anticipate that they are gonna continue up into this new land package. Okay, fantastic.
appreciate everybody uh, taking the time to, to view this video. Please feel to reach out with any questions and we look forward to a, a more press releases and more news coming in short order. Thank you.